Warm up group number one. The following competitors may now take the ice so for the first six minutes. Group of warm -up. six just about to take the ice here as we uh, unfortunately are getting some repeated announcements for people to leave the arena from the previous session here at the Almaty Arena. The uh, organisers not helped by a 15 minute delay to the start of the ice dance competition earlier this afternoon. Actually been left with about 15 minutes or so in which to completely empty the arena and get it filled up again. The arena has now been empty. We just started to see the first people come through and go to their seats in this wonderful 12,000 capacity arena. It's a real pity, really, for the, the first group here. be a pretty much an empty arena for this first group even the second group might in fact may struggle to get uh, a full arena it will be full though for the final group featuring of course Dennis Ten the Kazakh champion the former Four Seasons champion the former Asian Games champion the Olympic bronze medalist a world silver medalist uh, very possibly the biggest sporting star in Kazakhstan these days. And he's certainly already inspiring a whole new generation of skaters, and he's certainly inspired the public here as well. We've had a capacity crowd for each and every session of the figure skating here in Almaty. No mean feat with a near 12,000 capacity arena to fill fill it they have and the crowd have been passionate about their figure skating they've not just been cheering for the home skaters they've been cheering for everyone they've been really impartial a fantastic crowd to skate in front of them really every skater that's come come off the ice has been pretty much blown away by the level of support out there Of course, the support slightly more partisan for the uh, home skaters. They've had a certain amount of success. All three of the Kazakh skaters in the women's competition making it through to the free skate. That was Michael Neumann. He'll be first up, looking a little bit nervous. He's taking a tumble there in practice, the Slovakian champion, or rather the former Slovakian champion, I should say. Was 34th in this year's European Championships uh, just a short while ago in Ostrava. Six skaters going in this first group. We do start from young here. Another one of our wonderful Italian film crew here in Almaty. And thankfully now the seat's starting to fill up. It will take a while though. No mean feat at filling up an arena of this size. Uh, Demi Alboga with the beard qualified in the 24th and final place by the skin of his teeth for this free skate maybe that will free him up a little bit for this, or rather this evening skate just in front of me right now looking at really quite fluid as he goes through his paces on the ice Oh, some people that 
take to the camera somewhat easier than others. Skaters, there is one minute left in this warm-up. Just one minute left. I don't think we're going to have the, uh, the full capacity by the end of that one minute. The uh, full list of skaters in this first group there. Michael Neumann of Slovakia currently in 20th place. Say Kawahara of Japan in 23rd. Thomas Kennis of the Netherlands. Huge season's best for him to qualify 19th place. From Chinese Taipei, Sao Chi Yi, who uh, in 21st place had a bit of a personal disaster, quite frankly, in his short program. Andre Speigel of Sweden qualified in 22nd. And as we were saying just a few moments ago, Barak Demirboga of Turkey qualifying in the 24th and final place. Skaters, your warm up has ended. By just 0.25 of a point in the end. He had made it through to this stage. Bella Papp in 25th and Charlie Parry Evans of Great Britain in 26th, both within half a point of qualifying, just missing out for the second Universiade in a row for them both. Now then, that's the uh, warm up done and dusted. Hopefully, the fans that are in fact here for this uh, opening salvo of skaters in this men free programme 